Now two flags fly above my land that really sum up how I feel. One is the colors that fly high and proud, the red, the white, the blue. The other one's got a rattlesnake with a simple statement made. Don't tread on me is what it says, and I'll take that. Hey y'all, Big Bub here from Big Bub Outdoors. Uh, I had to take here? some time off my truck, deal with some family problems. So uh, how I, 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 I dealt with some of that and uh, how I uh, relieve stress is I go to the water. I um, have to do some thinking and yeah, just get stop. stuff done. Um, so uh, man a bug wanted to go catfishing so we're out here at Marum we're gonna do some catfishing uh, I know it's been a long time since I've posted anything and uh, my little rant I did have on here posted uh, I was told I had to delete it or I'd lose my job I so it in. got deleted um, <sighs> but we're gonna see what kind of day we have hey my nanny bug say hi bug we're going to see what kind of day we have out here at Maram do some catfishing. Uh, doesn't matter if we catch anything or not. It's just we good to be out. And, uh, relieve some stress and get my head on right where well, it needs to be. Gonna catch up, so. And uh, so it's a beautiful day. It's the first day. It's not rained nah. in a long time. Um, get a hush. So hopefully I bring y'all some fish. Uh, might do some some tutorial videos here soon talking about different types of rods um, custom rods um, different types of custom rods different types of higher end rods and good cheap rods you can buy to get yourself into catfishing and talk about tackle and stuff like that why I have a chance to do that because it's going to keep my mind off of the things that I need to that makes me worry so I'll catch y'all here in a little bit and hopefully I bring y'all some fish on this video. Now I got the first fish of the day. Come reel it up, reel it up, buggy. I got it! All Wait, right. Hang on. Daddy, it's kind of stuck. Can you get it? Yeah. It, it's a move. There we go. Just a little bitty guy, y'all. Good job, but Nanny. Nana's first catfish of the year. High five. So hopefully that Good means job. we'll have some more coming to this video. So I'll catch y'all here Hang in on. a little bit. Mommy's in a hole. Hang on. All right, y'all. Nana Bug got another one. Hang Keep on. reeling, Let's buggy. Let's scoot up a little bit so Mommy can get up. Really, man? Really, man? I am. Let's see what you got. Hang on. Hang on. Oh, no, 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 no. She got another fiddler. Let's see. Hang on. Right then. there. Makes two for Nanny Bug today. <laughs> she is on a roll. Hopefully I get to bring y'all something in this video. But if not, it's still good just to see her do it. See y'all here in a little bit. Don't be swinging it, Nana. Weirdo. Can I touch it? Hey, y'all Big Bub here. I think Nanny's got another fish on. Hang on, hang on. Keep reeling. Hang on. There he is. All right, buggy. Look out. Look out. It's three for her today. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Hold it, Nana. Putting them down, man. Me? Her and her little light up bobber. Kicking butt out here. Hopefully bring y'all some more here in a minute. Look. Hey, y'all. Big Bub here from Big Bub Outdoors. <laughs> Oh my God. Uh, sitting here with my buddy Cecil. He uh, finally got to meet up with me. Um, Indiana catfishing is yours, right? Yep. And, uh, hey guys, how y'all doing? Finally, YouTube meeting up. We've been talking about it for a while. Finally, was able to come out here. I was out here earlier this morning, afternoon, called a couple channel cats out here, but we went around a big circle to get here again from where we were at in Linton. But yeah. Finally made it. I got some other little YouTubers that's been watching my stuff with me. And uh yeah, well, 
I decided I was going to keep some catfish this time, which I don't really do. And uh, my big cord got cut, so I had to put another stringer on. And it's a little one. Put it in a basket, and huh, and it, uh, it it went in the water. <laughs> More than you needed. And uh, yeah, so uh, we got it back. I had to uh, set me up a, a snag rig to get my fishing basket back. Search and rescue out here in the. I really didn't a, want to get in the water. <laughs> and, but but we got we got it back. <laughs> And so, uh, yeah, if you, you toss it out too far, get you a treble hook and a little slip sinker above it and and uh, go play some search and rescue. You'll find it. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, I ain't really been catching nothing. It's just been a slow night. Nanny bugs outfished me, which that was worth all of it, being all, you know, last four months on a truck. Just being out here, letting her do her thing has been all worth it. So I'll catch you all here in a little bit. Hey y'all, Big Bub here from Big Bub Outdoors. I'm on my way home. Um, I probably could have caught quite a bit of fish, but um, it really wasn't about the fishing today. Um, it was more relieving stress and getting my mind right. Um, finally got to meet a good friend of mine. Uh, and we, he's another YouTuber. Uh, me and him been talking back and forth for many years now. Um, Cecil, he's a uh, catfish in Indiana on YouTube. Uh, we've been trying to hook up to do some fishing and whatnot. He was already out here at Merrim earlier and he found out that I was going to be here so he come back. Um, so I met up with him. I got to meet um, some nice people while I was down there. Uh, met a few other fishermen. Uh, gave him some sinkers and whatnot and that guy was so happy that I just gave him some sinkers and he, he you know I got all kinds of sinkers and whatnot it didn't bother me to give some away um, I've been there done that and it made that guy's day and he's like I'll, I'll pay you back and I, and I was I'm not worried about that you know if I can help out a feller fisherman you know that's what it's all about and I, I really wasn't paying attention to my rods like I said um, sitting there just shooting a bull with Cecil. Uh, it was just nice to actually get to meet him. And he's a really nice guy. Uh, we went through his rods that he's got and uh, I gave him a few tips on how to get a little more distance out of his his uh, bait casters because he's, uh, he's not really used to them yet. He's still quite new. And uh, the wife and the baby made some new friends, and I uh, got to meet a couple fans. A uh, young gentleman, he, uh, he's on this video. Uh, his mom said he couldn't get out of the car fast enough when he seen my car with my sticker on it. He knew I was out there. Uh, he talked to me quite a bit, and uh, I didn't video as much as I wanted. I have no clue what happened. Did it record at all? It's recording. I just don't know what happened to the light. Uh, well, I'll just turn this on. Sorry, y'all. My light died on my phone for some reason. But, uh, I didn't record everything like I normally do and give y'all a whole lot because, like I said, it was just a, a me day to try and get my mind straight to where I need to be right now. Uh, but it was nice to talk to Cecil and uh, talk to the, the new young, new young generation that that uh, watches my stuff like he, he knew every rod that I've made he knows every place I fish uh, every fish I've caught I mean he really uh, there's over 10 years of videos on there and this young man he's pretty much um, known them all so you know for doing that I think I have another hat left at the house we do and I think I'm going to give him a hat just because he knows everything I, I mean I, I appreciate you following and uh, he asked when this would be up it will be up very soon uh, as soon as I get home I'll have this uploaded um, call the number buddy that's on here at the beginning of the video and uh, I'll try and meet up with you guys at Merrim again the next time I come out I'll bring you a hat for free you have, you have one of these right here and I'll sign it for you 
give you a hat because of how much you knew of my stuff. I mean, I, I really appreciate that. Um, the new generation or even the older guys um, watching my stuff, telling me they've learned a lot of different things. And it uh, makes me feel good to, to run into people like that because I'm not, you know, some big fisherman. I'm just your everyday redneck. I just like doing my videos and I, I always hope that there it would help somebody and I know that it has so it's going to make me want to keep doing these. So this is Big Bub from Big Bub Outdoors. I'll either catch you in the woods, on the water, or I'll see you on the road. Bye bye. Bye bye.